Hello guys, today let's learn about the syndromic management for vaginal discharge. Now for this we have kits which are provided free of cost under the Ministry of Health and Family Welfare, Government of India. So first is the kit 1 which is the grey kit. This contains tablet cefixim 400 mg OD and tablet azithromycin 1 gram OD stat. Now this is given for cervical discharge. Apart from cervical discharge, this, this is also used for partner treatment in case of PID, any anorectal discharge and urethritis. Next is the kit 2. Now this contains, this is your green kit. Now this contains tablet fluconazole 150 mg uh, stat and tablet secnidazole which is given 2 gram stat. Now this is given for vaginal discharge. Next we have is the kit 6. Kit 6 is given for PID and this is the yellow kit. Any patient who complains of lower abdominal pain, rule out ectopic, uh, when you are come to a diagnosis of PID, that is on uh, PV examination, you find uterine tenderness, cervical motion tenderness, adnexal tenderness, and you come to a conclusion of PID, you are going to give her Kit 6. Kit 6 contains tablet toxicycline 100 mg BD, which is given for 14 days. Tablet metronidazole which is given 400 mg BD for 14 days and tablet cefixim which is given 400 mg OD for one day. Remember these kits are uh, given un uh, as a part of the syndromic management. So whenever a patient complains of vaginal discharge always take a thorough uh, history, do a, a, a per speculum examination, look for any local lesion in the cervix. It's always better to do a pap smear. Also rule out UTI that is urinary tract infection, advise urine routine and microscopy as well as culture sensitivity, rule out diabetes and then always rule out pregnancy when you have any suspicion for PID. Ectopic which is a very dangerous condition should always be ruled out and then you can advise the medication.